Yeah, okay. Hello and welcome to our Wenzel Online Expo. My name is Oliver Meschke and I want to show you our monitoring and analysis tool, the WM Sys Analyzer. Okay, so let's have a look at the agenda. So first of all, I want to show you what is the Sys Analyzer and what it is used for. And then I will explain um, how the structure of the system is. We will see the three different modules, monitoring, operations, and analytics, and which uh, functionalities they, um, they include. And at the end, I will summarize the benefits. Yeah, so what is the Sys Analyzer? The Sys Analyzer collects the data of the machine and its environment. And yeah, the collected data is displayed on an intuitive user interface and can use by the customer. And with the help of uh, yeah, with the help of a smartphone, tablet, or PC. Yeah. And which information do you get? You get, for example, the duration and the progress of your measuring program, or the status of your machine if it's in CNC mode, manual mode or idle mode are also error messages um, displayed uh, when there is a collision or there's no air supply or somebody presses the e-stop button yeah and you can check the workpiece and the surrounding temperature and if there is a change um, over a certain period of time yeah yeah and this data is really useful when you use automation solutions or you do serial measurements. Yeah, in case there is a collision or a malfunction, you can react really, really quickly. Yeah, and if you have one or several machines in your plant or all over the world, you can control them in one list and if they are busy or not. And in the following, you will see why this tool improves also your service maintenance and how it prevents your machine from being damaged. Yeah, so here's the concept of this application. Yeah, here you see um, a CMM with a controller and the controller collects the data and the data um, is uh, adapted and processed by a proxy and then there are some clients in the background which send this data to the local server or to the Wenzel server. Yeah, and then the user um, can use this by a web application and so in use with a, with a smartphone, tablet or PC. Yeah, and the requirements for the Sys Analyzer is a, a CMM with a controller, with a WPC 2040 controller, when you want to display the temperature, you need a temperature box, WPT100, and um, you need a measuring software, Quartus 2018-1 or a higher version. And uh, yeah, um, also you need, need an approved network connection. Yeah. So there are three different modules. So um, you have the monitoring module, which is our basic version. Um, this module is free for Wenzel customers. Then we have the operations module, which, include, uh, which includes advanced um, um, functionalities. And we have the analytics module, which is our uh, full version. Yeah, um, the prices are available on request. Please um, ask our sales department for this. Um, yeah, so um, with the monitoring module, one or several users can observe one single machine. Yeah, uh, you can see the state of the machine if it's in joystick mode, uh, manual mode, or idle mode. Or you see also when an error occurs, yeah, you get a notification. And when you click on the machine, yeah, and then you see the right picture, you see the feed rate, you see the workpiece temperature, you see the temp uh, surrounding temperature, 
And when you click on the errors tab, you see also all the hardware errors. And when you purchase the operations module for your machine, you see all your machine in one list. Yeah? And when you click there on, on a machine, yeah, you see additional um, information about the total running time, about the uh, operating time of the servo motors. Yeah. And below the work piece and the surrounding um, temperature, you see also uh, a graphic, the temperature curve. Here you see the changes um, over a period of time, and so you can check if your conditions are stable or not. Another advantage is the improved service. Um, with the help of the heat map, you can see the movement and the operation of a machine. And also you see the operation trend in each axis and also you get uh, feedback about the number uh, of kilometers in each axis, X, Y, and C. And yeah, this helps you and um, this helped also the service to make predictions about upcoming maintenance. And um, yeah, so the service can replace, uh, replace parts timely before they could cause problems. And so you avoid uh, downtimes. Yeah, when a, a, a Quartus program is running, you will see the expected time, you see the remaining time, and, uh, and so you know how much time you have left, and this is really comfortable when you have also other work to do, and you can optimize your workflow, and so you're more efficient. Yeah, the operations module, um, can display also the software and um, the hardware errors in detail. And if something is wrong with uh, the machine or with your process, you can retrace um, the problem really quickly. Maybe in the night shift there was a collision and so you can detect this with the sys analyzer. Yeah. Additionally to the web application, the analytics module uh, includes also a dashboard and um, with the dashboard you can check over a short or a, also a longer in period of time um, how busy the machine is you can see the downtimes caused by um, um, error mode or idling and when you and when you want to compare this machine to each other you can add them to a machine list yeah and so you can also optimize your workflow. Yeah, you can do the same with um, the workpiece and the surrounding temperature. Yeah, here you can also add um, choose one machine, or you can add also a second or a third machine. Yeah, and you can also check um, the frequency and the number of errors and which kind of error it is. Yeah, so um, with this information, you can take further steps to correct errors or uh, and improve your process. Yeah, and in the future, it is planned that the analytics tool uh, will warn you automatically when a repair of a machine is uh, required. And uh, yeah, in addition, it is also planned for the analytics tool that uh, um, it displays a uh, if your measurements are okay or not okay, and uh, how many features are within or outside tolerance. Yeah, that was the presentation about the three modules. Yeah, here, short summary of the advantages. Yeah, you know, on the one hand, it makes your process more efficient. Yeah, you have one or several machines in one list, you see, um, um, how busy they are, you can use them better and optimize your workflow, and so you achieve higher utilization. But it also makes your process more effective. Yeah? You can uh, recognize errors faster, you, uh, you can retrace them better, and so you can uh, reduce downtimes. And you can also avoid downtimes uh, 
because uh, it is also a service tool uh, and it prevents at an early stage uh, yeah uh, and so you yeah you avoid um, downtimes and this combination of higher efficiency and effectiveness means you save uh, costs and time yeah so that would be the end of my presentation if you have uh, any questions feel free to ask them in our chat uh, on our booth uh, on our software booth yeah and thank you uh, for listening and have a nice day